Hi, I'm Walters from Microtik. Let's talk about the Internet of Things. You have already seen our devices for LoRa. We have brought a cost-effective and flexible Microtik approach to the IoT world. Now it's time for the next step. NAT is our IoT gateway. It uses very low bandwidth, low cost cellular connection for IoT. Narrow band or MB and CATM. It is supported by many mobile operators all over the world. NAT supports protocols like HTTPS and MQTT that allow sending sensor data to the cloud or local server. What can it do? Well, with the Bluetooth interface, you can use the NAT for asset tracking and telemetry based on Bluetooth advertisement packets. NAT can send any Bluetooth advertisement data, iBeacon, Edistone, or any other format. It also has very powerful filters, forwarding only relevant packets and ignoring others. How would this work in the real life, you ask? Well, let's imagine a hospital. Lots of expensive assets moving across huge buildings. Tools, meds, equipment, you name it. Everything is moved around all the time. And usually hospitals are spending a lot of resources on inventory checking. But let's fix that. Let's add low-cost Bluetooth tag on all the important equipment and place NOT gateway in every storage room. Now the hospital management will always know if the equipment is returned to its place. But why stop there? You can also add a temperature sensor to all the critical medical supplies and use the NOT to keep track. So the possibilities are really endless. The NAT supports also a Modbus protocol. You can use the NAT as a TCP bridge from wired Modbus sensor to send readings to Modbus server. So yes, NAT brings wireless connectivity to wired sensors, such as electricity meters and relays. As for narrowband, NAT supports NB CATM low bandwidth, low cost backup connectivity in case of a lost Ethernet connection, or it could be used as a management channel for your network. NB CATM monthly plan is much cheaper than LTE, so why spend extra money on the bandwidth you don't need? For example, you can manage not powered vending machines with liquid and temperature sensors with only a few megabytes per day. The NAT is a truly universal device with a lot of connectivity options and protocol support. It features 2.4 GHz wireless, 200 megabit Ethernet ports with PoE in and PoE out, and a micro USB port. The device also has a GPIO header. You can use it for relay control, logical input output sensor connectivity, voltage metering, or home automation. There is also a separate NOT version with LoRa support coming soon. You will be able to use it as a LoRa gateway with MB CATM connectivity. This brings low cost connectivity for LoRa sensors in remote locations. So stay tuned. Make sure to check out our IoT products and start saving your time and money like never before. Contact your Microtik distributors for more information.